Hey everyone, welcome back to Alvin's Vehicle. So, uh, here is uh, the car I'm going to review th today. So, this is a, a 2021 new models. Well, right now it's 2022, but oh well. It's the Aston Martin V12 Speedster. The first color. It doesn't have a windshield. In the middle, it's not... There's actually a dashboard and stuff underneath. This casting pretty cool. PR5 wheels. V12 Speedster made in Malaysia. GRX. Wait, isn't that a... A speed racer team? Never mind. It's 58 P37 2021. The back is the windows, so... There's the fuel thing. There, mine actually has sort of a defect on it when I got it. There's some weird scratches on it. And I damaged it pretty badly. But I never, I never discovered the scratches until I opened the car. Damaged it by trying to crash it. The back has a license plate supposedly saying V12 Speedster. They're supposed to be the Aston Martin logo. They're still it. The lights. That big grill. So, it, uh, I just turned it upside down. Also got some side mirrors. The steering wheels here. Overall, it's a pretty good car. And I just noticed something. It The parking lot's supposed to be like this. And it's all of... HW Exotics. Well, it's all exotic vehicles inside parking. This showroom car technically counts as exotics. But so if you're wondering why there are so many missing cars right here, well, I'm going to just not tell you for now. Oh, just ignore the background sounds. This, that is absolutely nothing. can ignore all that. Be, uh, okay. So now we're going to have to go to the actual thing. That's important right here. The championship. November 6th tournament. So we got the VW Beetle fur to qualify for the finals. Versus the 1978 Dodge Monaco. Monaco gets the inside lane advantage. Bolt. Free races. Monaco gets the inside lane advantage. Well, I don't know if it's an advantage or not. We go. Looks like the Beetle takes it. Not sure, though. I don't have a replay. But I think the Beetle actually took it. We go. Beetle takes it again. Well, the finish line is here or here. I don't know. So, yeah. I would say Beetle took it by a good chunks, but final lane swap. I think Beetle took it, or Monica caught him up in up there, but Beetle took it there. So I guess, Monaco, goodbye. You're going to have to drive away. Now it's the Chevy van versus the Beetle. Well, Chevy van gets the inside lane. This. Well, Monaco's driving away. And, uh, yeah, please ignore this huge pile of vehicles. I'm gonna talk about 62 VW Beetle. Free. Free. Pretty well known. And the Chevy van. It's a retooled version. By the way, in the background, yesterday, well, June 24th, 2022, I got these free cars. They were the best. I saw a few Kafer racers, uh, Alfa Romeo 8Cs, Monster RX Freeze, some Rebels. So, yeah. That's, yeah. That's pretty much it. But I like these free the most. Oh, yeah. I think there was also a bunch of Drifts does and stuff, but anyways. So Chevy Van. So
75 Chevy van versus a 62 VW Beetle. Who would win? Or Actually, I don't know. Ah, Beetle just fell off. And to push them back onto the fence. Here we go. Ooh, Chevy van took it by a huge margin. Well, Beetle's the... Beetle got a better chance, but... Yeah. Well, the sandbags are starting to fall. And no, it. I don't like the Valentine's thing, but it's the only ramp I have. Oops. No, no, no. I accidentally held it. Yeah. Wait. Go. Well, Chevy Van still released it. We're going to switch the lanes. I don't know if the camera's even... Well, Chevy Van wins that one. I don't even know how many races that was, but Chevy Van is the new king of the hill. No, wait. Not yet. Not yet. Beetle just drove off. Beep, beep. Crashes into... Bump. Okay. Well, now we need to get our champion, which is also the Toyota to... Well, we need to run the car to beat thing. So, yeah. Yay, we're gonna... The car to beat. Chevy Van took that by a lot. Ooh, that was closer. Well, I... Well, technically Chevy Van still won. So the truck goes back in. Now, Tacoma versus Chevy Van. Well, the champion gets to have the inside advantage. And best of three wins. We... Ooh, Tacoma actually took the first one. Probably that inside lane advantage. Jenny Van takes the next one. Ooh, this is a good back and forth race. Ooh, Chevy Van actually took it. Okay, so now Chevy Van has two wins. Tacoma has one. Chevy Van takes it again. Chevy Van is your new king of the turbo hauler. And also, yeah, we need to do the car to beat thing. So let's see if the king of turbo... Old King of Turbo Holler is better than this Tacoma. Well, it's just a one race sort of thing. Don't have any newer matchbox? So, uh, yeah. We're going to run this. Ooh, first Tacoma takes it, so. Yeah, 2016 Tacoma goes here. This is your new car to beat. Well, Chevy Van's getting parked under this turbo hauler. And if you're wondering why the turbo hauler looks so empty, it's because I took out all the cars for a junkyard jow starting in July. And also, don't get me demonetized for trying to use uh, the junkyard jow words, team names, because... Uh, I am very uncreative. So here are the rally smashers. I don't know. This is the devastation wagons. Well, this is a wagon. I searched it up. Here are the British power. Yeah, no, that does not sound right. The multi-purpose racers. Most high purpose crashers. No, that does not sound right. MPC. Yeah, that sounds better. Industrial accidents. Yep, uncreative. Truculent, uncreative. Coffee cruisers. Okay, that sounds weird. And old racers because uh, they're old. I cast castings. Yeah. I guess it works. And also, sorry for not being able to comment on these old 
on the old videos, but I think I already said that, but oh well. I'ma just make it so that you can comment today after the video's posted. Well, pick which car I should open first. A majority of at least 60%. And I will go with it. But my vote counts as two. No. I'm not trying that tactic. Okay, maybe I am. But anyways, I vote Hummer, then Koenigsegg, then Lucid. But definitely just decide hum first Hummer or first Koenigsegg. Anyways, that's it for today's video. Also, this junk sort of vibe is good for crashing cars. Bye. Ding.